Hello, chess friends. This is Coach Andy. <coughs> yeah, today we continue our catch up of 365 chess master lessons, and this is day two. All this and the essential. Basically, this is talk about the back rank mate. Okay, last rank mate. Yeah, it's back rank basically. And um, now let's look at the game. The game actually played by Alakan, Alexander Alakan. So of course he is famous. If you don't know him, then I'm not sure what you learn from chess. Okay, so the opponent is some guy at the same area. Okay, now let's look at the game. <coughs> um, game starts with d4, d5, queens, um, not getting bit. Okay, queen pawn opening. And uh, why do knight jump? Okay, then do the queen scan bit. Just do a knight jump. Protect the pawn and uh, try to attack the e5 square. Discourage e5. And uh, black to e6. Yeah, you cannot go e5. Let's go e6. And uh, here, moving bishop back. Move, moving out of bishop is okay. Jumping knight is also okay. So he move e6. Now we move e3. It's a kind of symmetric. And knight coming back. Now this is definitely symmetric right now. With d3, knight jump. So far, a little bit different. But after knight jump and with d6. Now this is symmetric again. Okay. And uh, <coughs> we know, yeah, if your opponent try to play symmetric, and uh, usually um, white is the person to break the symmetric, and um, he will find a good time for him to break it up. Okay, right now he tried to break it right away because this pump push tried to exchange, and it's very hard also to do the pump push. Okay, so. <laughs> That's this problem. So he take, why take it with the knight? Of course, this is normal. Yeah, and uh, when we build up knight and bishop, pawn push should be the idea. Okay, we want to break out from the e4. Okay, so after take, knight take, and uh, here black, if black take, bishop take, knight at attack, bishop, bishop come back. So that's fine, I don't think that's a problem. And uh, basically, white will have a little bit more space than black. Mm, maybe a little bit more flexible because his bishop can go here, and the white bishop cannot get out because of this pawn. So yeah, he ca uh, he should take. Okay, he take we take. Yeah. So that's it. So now black just castle. He doesn't want to jump knight, and the bishop here is okay. It's attacking everywhere. Yeah, it's very powerful, but it's also not a stable place. So no need to driving him back right away. Okay, so that's why he won't delay it. And uh, now white, I think white attack right away. So white start attacking the queen and try to poke this. Okay, if you put this and this become weak. And uh, the king also, the cover of the king is weak. Okay, so usually this is kind of like a poking idea, testing. Testing, what what do you do? You are black and uh, do you want to weaken your pawn? Yeah, it's not like totally dead, okay? It's just to try to test. And uh, I'm not sure the Greek gift is working. No, right now it's not working because the knight can jump here. If you do this check, he take. Uh, knight check. Let's say he go back, and queen come over, and this knight jump is there. Okay, so let's say take, take, check. He go back. Sorry, wrong one. This check. And uh, he go back. Yeah, coming out is a little bit dangerous. Let's say he go back. We go here. Try to mate here. Now he jump knight. I have to save my queen. Coming back, I think. And uh, I don't see a mate. It's a playable, I believe, because we have strong attack. But yeah, I'm not sure. After he move away the rook, then the check is not that lethal. Yeah, he. W but we can still play. Okay, so um, we need to find some way to. Get over 
and uh, maybe let me turn on the engine okay so hold on let me try to turn on the engine <laughs> let's see i didn't have the engine who is better right now tell me black is better yeah it's 2.6 so black will start to blow out here basically yeah this night is there you cannot go here at all and uh, your h file cannot open i will blow up and try to simplify up to simplify down i up a piece okay a piece is three points right now i only marked at 2.65 um oh right now i'm up a white up a pound okay so that's not good okay so let's go back uh but this is some idea okay always keep some idea in your mind and um yeah so after the castle, we do bishop here. Now try to force him back. I uh, force him to lose the pawn structure. And um, he didn't try it. Okay, so he wants to hold on the pawn structure, move the rook king over. And should we castle? I think we should castle now. It's this line, right? So I could not leave this line. Oh, yes, let's castle. And uh, here now, what should black do? Right, so that's the question. Um, jumping knight here definitely not good because bishop is already here. After you jump here, I will just take on you. Then it's a, it's a very bad pawn structure, and uh, also, yeah, the g file gets opened. This pawn gets weak. Okay, we already have a sun something attack it. Yeah, you have double pawn. You may block me. That's the one thing. Okay, so now should I stop you? Like push your pawn. Let's get rid of this pawn so the block is not that lethal something like that okay so that's not good you don't want to jump knight here now if you don't jump here should you jump there that looks like out of the board because that side is nothing so maybe push pawn is the one something we should consider try to kick you but push pawn also weakening the pawn cover right so and uh, but this might be the best okay so kick him back then we jump knight here okay so you don't want um the bishop had no place to go going here is nothing going here is nothing yeah so so i need to move the bishop knight and then i can move this bishop i can maybe move the rook out develop right or maybe move this is some idea okay so try to dumbify this then my bishop can go back, drop him back, and um, something. Okay, so let's see. Uh, he pushed pawn. Now this move is, um, of course, it's weakening the pawn structure, right? There are no pawn covered f7 anymore. And also make this pawn backward. That's another problem. Okay, white has no choice. Okay, he had to go back. There are no choice. Now at this moment, if you don't push pawn, you almost will never be able to push pawn because he will come over then he will one two three yeah you have one two three oh sorry this one um then after you push he take you take i think sometimes somewhere he can pin you okay so that's a problem so basically black wants push pawn right away so it's a backward pawn okay so that's a weakness so basically after this f5 the, the black just create a weakness for himself okay when he go back he push pawn now after this push and uh, of course i cannot let him push again if we push again there's a double attack so i have to take no choice i take he take okay now the nature move i will just ping it okay here black can still do nature move like take 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 exchange and uh, position wise should be okay yeah hitting the queen but the queen can move yeah this should be okay they're not big deal and yeah actually take is the best move now what he did is he queen go queen out okay so this is a blunder basically he based on the idea like he may be able to take the bishop okay so now he take the knight is a remove defender right so after take you take the back i take your bishop because knight is the bishop's defender okay so um yes this is remove defender but this also is a blunder because he didn't black didn't notice 
the diagonal is weak. Okay, so because he already moved f pawn, f pawn gone, bishop can go c4 check, that's a tempo. Okay, so after tempo, then he had to drive to the corner, there will be a back rank issue. So basically, he take the knight first. Yeah, now you have to take this bishop because if you take my rook, I take the back, I'm already up a knight. Okay, so you take that exchange. So that's not good. So you have to take my bishop, there's no choice. Then everything else is kind of continuous. It's very nature. So we will do this check. You have to go in. Now the next move is uh, kind of like a surprise because uh, right now actually it looks like I have four piece. Queen, Rook, Queen, Rook, Knight, Bishop. Yeah. And versus Queen, Rook, Bishop. Okay, there's a pawn protect Bishop. But uh, you should see this move. This move is good because uh, the back rank. Okay, so if you take, I may be able to check here and the back rank. Of course, right now there's issue. There's a defender of the rook. Okay, that bishop. And uh, I told my student every time you hear her hear about the word defender, you have to think about can I remove it? Yes, I can remove it. Of course, here I have to remove it with the queen. So I will take on that bishop and he take the back. Oh, sorry, did he move that? Okay, so I take on a bishop. Okay, so he actually just tried to grab a pawn back. Okay, so that's fine. So in the, this is the game continuation. Okay, so he did this, take this, we take the back and uh, resign. Okay, so now, but yeah, because he done a piece and uh, down a piece, just down a piece. Okay, so he cannot hold a pawn up even because I have this check, this take, I get in the pawn back. And then I will just double the rook and not double the rook, just move another rook into open file. He's not developing this, he down a piece. Pawn is the same, five pound versus five pound. So that's losing. Okay, so now let's see the valuation. Okay, so what he didn't do, what he didn't do is, of course, he take back my queen. Then we will do this check. Now the big problem with this check is you cannot take me. And if you take me, this will lead to mate. That's the back rank, okay? That's the topic, essential and oldest checkmate pattern. So you cannot take me, then you have to move the king out, then we will pick up the queen. So we get the bishop, pick up the queen, We'll come back, pick up the pawn. It will be same thing, and uh, we up a pawn, another pawn. So same problem, and it's losing. So that's it. So basically, yeah, uh, here this at this moment, this is just tactic. Okay, so basically, it's a back rank, and there's a defender, and there's a double attack. Knight jump here, check, and get double attack. So. To make everything working, we just need to calculate which move first, right? Remove this defender because when you remove the defender, it's not forced, okay? You get a piece. Yeah, he, he can just not take you. Just uh, admit that uh, losing that piece. But um, of course, it's not very good, but but that's uh, that's possible, okay? And um, so it's, uh, do the non-forcing move first. Okay, knight jump is almost forced. Okay, take the bishop is not forced. Knight jump is a check, okay. So do the unforced move first. Yeah, couple move we need to do. Take this, knight jump, maybe possible we will go down check. Okay, so, and uh, basically you will choose the knight jump first or take the bishop first. You want to take the bishop first, okay. Okay, let's stop here and uh, yeah, back rank mate is always common, even in the high level. This is uh, this this is still happening. Okay, okay, let's stop, and uh, I see you in the next lesson.